This park is very special because it's one of the largest urban wilderness parks in the world. It's uh, almost 27,000 acres, and it's in the middle of a major city in Texas, El Paso. The mountain really does just kind of come right out of the middle of the city. And it's really like you just stepped into another world. A lot of our visitors, that's why they come here. They want to get away, and they want to feel like they've just left everything behind. You got me? Yep, I got gotcha. you. The mountains hold a lot of different secret places, or I would say sacred places for some people. This park was created by the community. The community back in the 1970s fought to protect the mountains and persuade the local government and the state government to purchase the land and establish Franklin Mountain State Park. That's kind of an interesting thing about a lot of these trails, if you stay in the shade. For the most part, people come out to Franklin Mountain State Park for the trails. So we're out here hiking the Aztec Cave Trail, which is about a mile and a half getting to the top. Hiking is one of my lifelines. I love it. It helps me to clear my mind and I can meditate. Breathtaking views of El Paso. Where else could you hike and see two countries and three states? Yeah, you would be hard pressed to find any place that matches this, any place in the world. If you look from the road, actually, it looks like a small opening, yeah. but it actually opens up to a very large cave. You can see the whole valley below us. There's a lot of different tours that we offer each month. Some of them like the one to Aztec Cave. But sometimes we'll also do tours to our mines. With the mines, you're crawling down in these small spaces and getting to explore this old mine shaft. Woo! Go, 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 go! We've got over 100 miles worth of trails. So you can ride all day and you will never ride the same trail. You can get to some of the trails right from a parking lot so you don't have to even go very far. You just basically ride off your car and, and ride a nice smooth trail as a beginner. Or you can hit some of the more technical stuff and go all the way to the top. Push it, push it, all right! Oh, good job. Woo! You can ride with groups, you can ride solo, and you've got this whole mountain behind me that you can ride all the way around if you want to. All the fun. Oh, yeah, great time. Maybe next time you guys invite me. It was good, it was good. What's nice about our campsites is it's an easy weekend getaway. <laughs> nice. What? We're about 15 minutes away from the nearest big store. We're already started now. <laughs> These mountains are challenging, but they're also so rewarding. Watching that sunrise, every moment the colors change, every shadow on the mountain is changing, and it almost makes it like it's a new trail every single time. We have so many people that come here uh, to heal. Natural therapy. They're not only doing exercise, but their mind is getting clearer. You could have the worst day ever, and you come out, and you're not feeling it. And by the time you're done, you feel like you can do anything. You can conquer the world.
here we have fresh air. You breathe, you feel alive, and then you re-energize every time that you come to these mountains. <laughs>